Hey, fanboy nation. This is your pal Daffy Duck, and you're watching. You're watching. We're watching. You're watching. Fanboy. 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 A fanboy, etc. Fanboy nation. Dot. I assume. Uh, um. <laughs> I love talking to you because even though they gave us five minutes, I know it could turn into 20 easy. <laughs> you can't shut me up. <laughs> well, that's good because we don't want to drag it out of you. Living legend Eric Goldberg. I mean, come on. You've been here for the evolution of the of this character, Mickey Mouse. Uh, you know, we're celebrating the centennial of Disney. And here we are. You know, this little mouse built Anaheim, built Orlando. You know, and built an entire franchise that now owns uh, pretty much the entertainment industry. <laughs> Boy, are his arms tired. But um, yeah. <laughs> you know, what is it like for you? Not only the recognition that you've earned and you deserve, but to also see the evolution of this character from Walt initially wanting to call him Mortimer to his <laughs> wife renaming him to Mickey, and then all of a sudden now owning the world. You know, he's still a mouse. And he's still a mouse with flaws, and he's still a mouse with tons of personality and engaging movements and behavior. And, you know, it's interesting because some people want to put Mickey in the past. And myself and my cohorts here, like Mark Han and Randy Haycock, who also animated on Mickey in a minute, uh, you know, we look at these characters as they're still alive. You know, we have to look at them as if they're still alive. They're not in the past. And I can look at a film from 1941 and still marvel at how alive Mickey is. And we try and get that into the work that we are doing with the character these days. And we've animated a lot of Mickey, not just for this documentary, but for creative legacy and projection shows and special projects and stuff like that. So you know, Mickey is absolutely one of our favorites and he is here and present. And I think that's the thing that I, I would hope people take away from it is he's here, he's alive and he's still kicking. <laughs> what is it about this mouse that changed the entire world? I mean, we have Superman as an iconic character. Mm -hmm. You know, Donald Duck is absolutely one of my favorite Disney characters. You know, Woody Woodpecker still, still is recognizable, but this little mouse set everything off for the world of animation and like why why does he resonate so much with all of us i think mickey resonates the resonates right <laughs> i think mickey resonates with people because he's one of us he's he's kind of mouse every man every mouse if you will and you know his foibles are our foibles. His triumphs are our triumphs. And generally, he's a decent guy who tries to do the right thing. He screws up once in a while, but he's absolutely, you know, somebody we can relate to. And I think that really accounts for his universality over all of these decades is that we all see a little bit of ourselves in him. Uh, Eric, I'm going to leave you with these last two comments. One, I'm pretty sure Mickey Mouse has the most write-in votes for President of the United States <laughs> in the history of Mickey Mouse. <laughs> and two, what does he mean to you? To me, Mickey Mouse is animation. He is the perfect animation character because he can do anything you can put him in any environment you can twist his shapes around you can do anything with him and he still feels great in any situation and i think that you know the fact that the animation medium is so pliable and so you know full of vitality mickey is that Eric Goldberg, it is always a pleasure to chat with you, at, whether it's at D23, whether it's here <laughs> or at Disney Animation Studios. Uh, where can we find you on social media before I let you go? And let's remind everybody that Mickey, the story of a mouse is uh, going to be available on Disney Plus on November uh, 18th. Mickey's birthday. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm not on social media, I'm afraid, uh, you know, so I, I, I can't ask anybody to come uh, come visit me, but uh uh, I'm looking forward to people seeing the documentary and hoping they enjoy it. 
Well, it's fan it's a fantastic documentary. It's great chatting with you. And then maybe one day we'll sing the Mickey Mouse Club theme song, Walking Up and Down Main Street, USA at Disneyland. All right. That sounds good. You, we've, we have a date. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Eric. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Bye.